maybe this is the thing that I really enjoy doing and that people get something out of. Um, and then I really started to think about like whether I could make it a career, and that was the scariest part because I don't know. The, I guess the background that I come from, like the family that I come from, and the community that I come from, it it was pretty unusual to think about music as a career. So I had a lot of resistance in my own head about, well, like if I go into this, how am I going to make it work? You know, how am I going to make money? Or like, what am I going to do when I'm 45 or 50? Will I still be writing songs? And those are all questions that I had to grapple with before I went into it. But uh, once I decided that life was too short for me not to try it, then that kind of made the rest of it easy. And then, it, then it was just a matter of like doing all of the research for like how do you get a record deal with a major label, or like is that really even what somebody should do? And like how do you tour? How do you start to sell CDs? How do you get publicity? And that was like the whole world of questions that I had to take on once I made the decision to do it. Question. <laughs> Have you guys liked New York? Is it cool? It's really cool. <laughs> cold, really cool. It's <laughs> in fact very cold right now. Yeah. Beyond cool. Um, I, I love it. I love it a lot because um, I think it matches a lot of things that I value in my life and it also takes away some of the things that I didn't enjoy like I didn't like being dependent on a car and I didn't like I never really was into cars or car culture and stuff and so I liked being able to go get everywhere and have do your life without having to have a car and, um, and I like being able to order Thai food at three in the morning, <laughs> have it brought to your door, and uh, mostly I just like getting, um, being around amazing people, and especially for careers like music and sort of creative things. There's so many people there that simultaneously inspire you and intimidate the hell out of you <laughs> because there's so many really really good people there. And so it's a good place to go and I guess see how you, uh, you know, how you stack up and, and really get a sense of where you're at um, with your community of, of your field. Actually on the plane ride home um, to California I suddenly thought of the perfect analogy for my moving to New York. I would um, well, like, I thought of it basically like, I moved to New York just this past April, so I'm still like completely infatuated. New York is awesome! It's amazing. <laughs> There's nothing annoying about it at all! Um, but I realized it's kind of like freshman year of college. Um, because when you get to, to college and everyone's there for the first time, and they all come from you know, whatever background they've come from, but they're all in this new place together. And so it's this environment where everyone's really open to making new friends and to being exposed to new things and like trying to step out. And uh, just like there, there's a kind of open attitude that you kind of lose once people get a little more settled into um, who their friends are or like what they're doing. And that's what I like about New York because it's basically like one big freshman year of college. Like the whole city is filled with people who are, are coming into the city with the intention of opening up their horizons a bit. And so I think it's a lot easier to make new friends and to find people who are excited about what they're doing and wanting to learn more about it. So it's a kind of, it's a really cool energy to be in. And that's why. <laughs> oh, you want us to go play? <laughs> Stop talking! <laughs> All right, is there anything else? Talking here. <laughs> I mean, we can talk or we can play, whatever you guys want. Play. <laughs> Hey. Hey. Okay. Yeah, you both have to say So I'll talk. <laughs> so maybe you can strum guitar and I'll talk and I'll <laughs> play piano under your talk. I think that's what I'm Yeah. Yeah. I'd ask you that 15 times before we got here. I think we should do your song. First. <laughs>